Hi, gay. Happy Pride Month. <laughs> Hi everyone, it's me Raymond and I am back today, I know what's going on, um, to bring you a doll review. And today we're gonna look at um, like, so, okay, so I want, I was watching QP83, love her and Barbie0913, um, they're fab. And um, well, I was re-watching like some old videos too. And so I watched her video on like her Skipper collection, her Courtney collection, that kind of stuff. And I thought to myself, geez, I really need to like get some things that I kind of am missing from those collections of my own. So um, I was like, you know what? Courtney's like my fave. I'm gonna get um, the, some of the Courtney's that I'm missing. I'm gonna make that like my goal for the rest of the year is to get like the rest of the Courtney's that I need. And um, so today we're gonna take a look at one of those gals. This is Pet Pals. I did not intend for that to rhyme. Courtney. So um, I actually had the Skipper. I've had her for a long time. I don't think I reviewed her for this channel. Sorry, I actually don't even know if I was doing videos then. I don't remember. That would have been like the very beginning of me doing videos. I don't remember, to be honest with you, because it's it's been a long time. Um, I got her at a, at a like, like a swap meet, I think. And it was really interesting. But anyway, so I've had her for a long time. I've always wanted Courtney. Courtney has a freaking cat and I'm way more of a cat person than a dog person. Sorry, I love dogs, but like, I don't want one. Um, anyway, enough about me. So she has a cat, like that's like a no brainer that I would want it. Um, and she's Courtney and I love Courtney. I don't know what it is about Barbies. Well, I love Skipper too. Like I do love Skipper. But um, I just love Courtney. I don't know. Um, Pizza Party Courtney is like my, one of my favorite dolls of all time, like hands down. Um, and I do love um, the babysitter one. I don't have her yet either. Um, and I'm trying to think of, I love phone, phone Courtney. She's, she's cute too. But yeah, anyway, I love Courtney. So there you go, guys. Um, and this is one of the earlier ones. I, I wouldn't say like the early, early ones, but she's definitely one of the early ones. She's interesting because she has blue eyes. A lot of the Courtney's that I know have either brown or green or sometimes hazel eyes. So I don't know if this is the first blue eyed skipper, um, but she's definitely one of the first ones. Not skipper, Courtney. Did I say, I don't know what I said just now. Um, but anyway. <laughs> So, <laughs> so uh, yeah, so let's just take a look. This is like a fun little line. I like their clothes aren't my favorite or anything, but like they're really cute. It's like a theme, you know, and it's not like, it's like an everyday kind of doll. Like it's not really like, it's like a theme, but it's not like, you know, like totally hair or something or like, um, I'm trying to think of something that's that's more like like prom or something. You know what I mean? Like it's not stereotypical like princess Barbie skipper, you know? They didn't really do a lot of that then. They did like a lot of stuff like this. So anyway, and I even love the logo and I love, this is like the years of like the yellow logo, which I think is cool. So, um, so there's the logo. It says, uh, what does that say? Special pet for the active team. I'm sorry, it's backwards on my screen. So special pet for the active teen, ad adorable kitty with her own carrier. So there's a picture of the kitty cat. Um, it says best friend of Skipper, caution for ages three, for over three years. Hopefully um, I'm okay then. Uh, there is a Toys R Us sticker on the side and it says, gosh, this was, this is $4.97. I wish I had paid $4.97 for this <laughs> Um, I don't know what that says, but it says ball for something. Um, time for breakfast and a walk. Cardboard carrier that's easy to assemble. So what I find interesting is that this cat has a bone. Don't know what they think cats like. This cat also has a leash. I mean, I've done that, but like cats don't love that. And then that's the child putting the carrier together. Maybe she had her parents do it because she's like, I'm not doing that. 
So anyway, that is what she looks like in the box. She's really cute, but let's get her the F out. Oh, I didn't even look at the back. Oops. I'm so excited. I like, I want to take her out of the box so bad. <laughs> okay. Um, pet pals, Courtney hanging out and having fun with their pets. So there's Kevin, Courtney and Skipper. Um, there's also an African American Skipper as well. Skipper and her friends have the cutest pets. Skipper and Kevin love playing with their puppies and Courtney, her kitty. Everywhere they go, their pets go too. So they both have dogs and she is the only one with a cat. Because Courtney clearly has the best taste. Even though, I'm going to be honest, I don't love her outfit. Like, I think, well, we'll, we'll look at it in a minute. But So he has like a Dalmatian and like a Dalmatian themed outfit. And she's got like a little like terrier kind of dog and uh yeah her outfit doesn't really go with her dog but anyway so um yeah let's take this girl out and have a look shall we oh i love that sound <laughs> oh that was so easy that was so easy guys wow okay love that She has some like fun stuff in here for me. Like a no booklet, oh, man. But she does have her pet carrier. Okay. Oh. oh, you are cute. All right, and one, two, three, twist ties on the back. Oh, she smells old. I love that smell, the new doll smell from like, the new vintage doll smell, I should say. There's just no smell quite like it, I don't know. Okay, there's four twist ties, I lied. I'm like really bad at counting because I did that in the last video too. <laughs> and my cats are playing. You hear them? <laughs> All right, so I am back after some assembly um, that I made an adult do, um, which, was myself. <laughs> um, so I got her out of the box. She's really cute. She's definitely got a scent to her. Um, I don't know how to explain it. It just smells like really old, like vinyl. Like, I don't know. Um, so there's an interesting thing that I almost forgot to mention that, um, so these, this Skipper and um, Courtney, they have a new, I'm pretty sure a new sculpt for the arms that are slightly more bent. Um, and that is so that, of course, they can hold their animal and, and play with them and walk them and that kind of thing. So I don't know if these arms were ever used again for anything else, but I, or b before or after, uh, I don't know, but they are different than the typical arms that were used for the Skipper dolls um, at this time. So I just thought that was um, something to note. Um, I had to put together the little carrier, um, and I will show you that and hopefully don't laugh at me too much. Um, but anyway, so she has like purple tights on and they're like knee length. Um, she's got, you no know, like a stretchy material, um, and they're just, uh, they have an elastic waistband. They're like bicycling shorts, basically. Um, so she's got a like a little dress over it and it Velcros in the back. It has a photo of her kitty on it. Well, like not a photo, but like an artistic rendering of her kitty. Um, and the cat has like a bow and just kind of looks like a sassy kitty cat. It's purple. Um, and it, it's, Oh, the, okay, so the print on here kind of looks like abstract cats on her shirt. Maybe that's just a coincidence. I don't know. But I the orange to me is a little weird. I don't know why. It, it just looks a little weird. But maybe that's just me. She actually has a, um, a shirt underneath so that you could, you could wear this outfit two ways if you wanted to change it up so her shirt is the same print as the um as the like skirt of the dress so there you go she could wear this if she wanted which is a, is a lot more cute to me <laughs> i don't know her bow matches her her outfit as well 
Like I said, she has blue eyes. She has purple eyeshadow. Um, kind of a red, like a pinky red lip, kind of like a rose color. Um, some rosy cheeks. She uses the sculpt from the 80s. It's like kind of anime looking, I've, I've heard people say. Um, she's got, of course, fluffy little bangs and the ever important crimped hair. And it's really just crimped at the bottom of her hair. It's not really crimped up here, which I think is kind of interesting. Crimp crimpers, Skipper's hair is crimped too, but I think it's more her whole head. Um, it's even more so just down here in the back. But um, but yeah, she's, she's really cute. She's a really, really cute doll. And I love, again, I love Courtney's. Um, she was always one of my faves. And, you know, a character I kind of miss seeing in the line today. But, you know, nobody has names anymore. So um, we did get instructions on how to put together the collar and the leash for the cat. I'm not going to put the leash on the cat or the collar, to be honest with you. Um, but I will show you those right now. So... This is just a little strip that has like a hook on there and you just wrap it around the cat's neck and you put the collar through here and then you have your little like, well, I guess it's not a dog tag, but you know what it is, it's a cat tag. So that's, that's how you do that and then you just hook it to the cat um, and then you literally just um, slip this so here's the leash and you just slip that through there and then this is where the doll will hold the, the animal and it's the same for all of the animals i mean the picture literally has the mold for um kevin's dog so so that's that i will not be putting that on the kitty um i will show you the kitty and then i'll show you the rest of the accessories so um let me make sure i don't lose that little ball so the kitty is very cute and I hope that my camera will focus on the kitty and not me. Um, it's not wanting to focus on me or on the cat. I mean, sorry, it is wanting to focus on me. Is that better? I don't know. It's better than it was, but okay. Anyway, the cat has green, like olive green eyes it's an orange kitty cat, which I love orange kitty cats. I don't have one of my own. Mine are both black. Um, he's got like tan paws and the tip of the tail and the face. And he's got little like, it looks like freckles, but it's supposed to be like where his whiskers are. And a purple bow to match hers, which is really sweet. But this is a really cute cat. I don't know how long they used this mold. It says 1991. So I'd imagine this is the first time they used it. Um, because this doll is from 1991, by the way. Um, so the rest of the accessories include the aforementioned um, <laughs> carrier that I had to assemble myself. It's looking a little rickety. This was already like kind of bent in the box, so I can't really help that. Um, but, you know... As my grandmother would say, it is what it is. Um, it is cute though. It's cute. It has like paw prints all over it and like circles and what looks like like little balls. And the color scheme is like purple green. It's cute. She has um, purple shoes as well. I'm going to put them in hot water so they don't crack when I put them on her or I don't know. Maybe they will, but I've had success in doing that. Like sometimes if you just expose stuff to like hot water and let it like expand or whatever, I don't know. I don't know how the science of that works, but um, sometimes it helps a little bit. Um, so I have, I don't know about you, but I have issues with, with shoes cracking. Um, so we have a bowl for the cat for the food and water. And it is purple, like a really light, like lavender. We have a, a bone, like a dog bone for the cat to play with. 
which is interesting. You would have thought they would have done something a little more specific to the cat, but I understand them reusing molds. Um, there's also a little ball and a can of food. It does not have a sticker to put on there. You just have to use your imagination and that's okay. <laughs> um, but that's really it. There's not a lot to it. There's a lot of opportunity for play though, which I like. Um, a lot of little accessories are not all cardboard and uh, I like that. So anyway, this has been Pet Pals Courtney. I hope that you enjoyed taking a look at her and her little kitty friend with me. I'll have to think of a name for him. He kind of looks like the cat from like Oliver and Company. So maybe that's what we'll call him. Isn't that that movie with the orange cat, I think? I don't know. I know there's a movie with an orange cat from around that time. Anyway, hi. <laughs> so I hope you had a good time um, looking at this doll with me. And um, I will see you guys again next time when we take a look at another, another doll or whatever. Whatever I feel like throwing at you. Gotta keep you on your toes. <laughs> Gosh, golly gee whiz.